Hello guys, uh, this is Amit Singh here and um, today I'll be showing you a video of SOAP UI uh, download, downloading SOAP UI and um, usually I do selenium videos but this video will be different um, so basically you go to google.com in the search box you can put SOAP UI download or you can put um, SOAP UI.org um, the URL either way it works and over here it will be just straight down simple um, you go latest release or you go to their home functions uh, I mean uh, you, their, their home page go from there and you download it from here or you can either go to latest release I recommend latest and um, according to your machine pick your need mine was 64 so I downloaded that and um, just click on download it will take some time it will be there and once you done all that you'll have this in your recent downloads just run it. <coughs> um, downloading from the internet uh, takes you a while. It took me around 10 minutes. So be patient. Yeah. Soap UI is no longer called Soap UI Pro. Um, and this is uh, they added that NG feature to it, which is next generation. Uh, Selenium has it. Mm. Selenium has test NG like annotations wise and um, yeah just go according to the flow and um, just go defaults so this one I'll be putting I, I made a separate folder for SOAP UI and uh, if you want you can do that if you don't want you don't have to but I did it so I can be organized uh, when it comes to SOAP UI and accept next uh, I'll be putting everything in that folder Except for one of the files. I don't see so few images. Next. Okay. Yep. Great. I'll take this away. And it will take a while. Okay. So all the files have been uh, extracted. It will automatically launch it, or um, you will see something like this: Ready API 1.1.0. So give it a minute. All right. So it will say, "No license found." You say yes. I want to install a license. Click over here. Um, add update. Okay. So remember, uh, I had put the license in our, you know, in our, uh, what do you call our uh, SOAP UI folder? Where is this? Oh, okay. Uh, right here. And SOAP UI. Two tools. Oh, sorry. Apologies. Uh, the license you would get it in your email. It will it will look something like this. The trial key. So you got uh, so if you got trial key, um, service key, load UI. Basically, it will be a zip folder. You unzip it. Um, I stored it back in the desktop, so I'll go there. I'll go here. I'll do so if you got trial key. Click OK. Uh, I had already used it in the previous one, um, so I can't use it. So let me just try something else. I'll try using so UI. Whoa. Sorry, apologies. Uh, my bad. Let's just use this for the time being. Yeah, even. Even for the other one, uh, you just click on the SOAP UI NG and go for it. Since I already did it, I couldn't redo it again and um, I thought I might be able to. But no, the system actually stores to it. Click OK. Install. Successful. I will just tell you how to, how to function it. OK. And OK. And now go over here, click New Project.
pick. Whistle. WADL. The disc for rest. Whistle is for soap. Don't click soap. Go here. Okay. For whistle, go to browser. Since I already put it in my um, SOPI folder. Under program folders. Um, I'll just go over here. One second. Folder. Whistle. Whistle. Okay. And here we go. You can start testing. Uh, this is just how to install Sophia, but not how to use it right now. So keep in mind. And um, so that's how you install it. That's how you get it to function. This is a trial key for 14 days. Have fun with it. Explore it. And I uh, might be making more videos on SOAP UI, how to test it, how to do load, load testing, functional testing, aggression, all that good stuff. Thank you for watching.